My name's Callum Preston. I'm an artist from Melbourne, Australia. I've had a lot of different jobs, which has led me to here. This is The Shack. It's my studio, design office, workshop, and it's where I do my job day to day. I'm inviting talented people to come in and chat about all things work and jobs and to perform just for you, live here in my studio. This is The Shack Sessions. Today at The Shack, Paul Dempsey. Paul, a Callum. pleasure. Welcome. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks for coming for, down. Thanks for having me. The band really took off very early in your life. Mm. So is there some job history pre something for Kate that we can discuss? Yeah, a little bit. The first kind of thing I did regularly, um, I guess it was a job. I had a boss. I didn't get paid very okay. well, but at Corumban Sanctuary on the Gold Coast. Okay. We lived up there when I was 12, 13, 14. My cousin kind of roped me into this thing where just uh, on the weekends we would go down and basically help the wildlife ranger feeding all the animals and cleaning their enclosures and which basically involved the ranger fending off whatever animal it was with a rake yeah while we bolted in changed like yeah. food trays or whatever they were and they kind of climbed safely back over the fence again so they were like you know there were freshwater crocodile koalas and dingoes and Stuff like that, all Australian. And he kept, you know, he used to always show us his thumb that he'd lost. Uh, probably, oh. you know, just did it himself in his garage, like <laughs> he has know, an angle being grinder. an idiot with a yeah. saw or whatever. <laughs> After that, we moved to the Mornington Peninsula and I got a job in the local kind of deli as a cleanup boy in the butcher section, yep. sliding carcasses around on the hooks. I'd just be cleaning fridges and, you know. Right. So not dissimilar to the first job, but just less animated animals. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. What's the worst job you've ever had? Yeah, look, I, I waited tables. I realized pretty quickly that that wasn't for me. I probably wasn't very good at it, but I yeah. also didn't have the temperament. Luckily, I just um, I spoke to the boss and I started working in the kitchen. I actually ended up loving that job because I started doing all the kitchen prep. So I would go in there when no one was okay. in there. Just being alone and being able to turn on stereo yeah and just listen to records whilst doing some mindless menial task that was great Feeling understood 
what you 